Hey guys, happy Friday. Welcome back to my channel. Tonight's video is all about jealousy. Now, the reason I chose this topic is because some of my clients that I've been uh, coaching have been expressing lately um, that coworkers, family, friends uh, have been showing some signs of jealousy toward their weight loss um, and trying to sabotage. And that is something that if any of you have been on any kind of eating program and have lost weight or inches or both, uh, can probably attest to have been um, at least have an experience with and it's really sad and unfortunate so this video is going to be um, very brief but in essence how to deal with it now if you have supportive friends and family and co-workers or you know one of them you should have no problem clearly the issue lies within the person who's jealous and if they make comments to you or they really don't respect your way of eating um, for whatever their reason may be, clearly that person is not really worthy of your time. And it's really sad because as a woman, um, pretty much all of us can attest that a lot of women are cruel and they love if they're miserable, they want everybody to be miserable. Um, it's very difficult for some people to watch somebody transform, speak about their transformation, and be supportive. And it's really sad. Um, I've had it happen to me a couple times. Uh, those people are no longer in my world. And that's fine with me. And again, the people that I'm coaching uh, are really the ones that are expressing to me, you know, how to handle the situation. So my best advice to you guys, as well as anybody else out there who is going through this, has gone through this, or will be at some point approached by somebody who uh, just really can't be supportive of you. Um, you don't have to explain yourself to anybody. Don't feel the need you have to. It's just you want to know you know, what I'm doing to lose weight, ask me in a nice way and I will be happy to share, right? But if these people are trying to sabotage and uh, things like that, you could always throw out there like, why do you eat the way you do? Why do you eat all the sugar and all the crap and whatever? And why do you gain 30 pounds every winter and then try to get it off before the summer? You know, um, it works both ways. So my advice, guys, is just stick with plans, stay focused, do what's right for you and realize that not everybody in this world is going to be supportive. There's going to be people who just, like I said, want to sabotage you or just people that want to be mean. Forget about it. You are in charge of your own destiny. You're in charge of what you do in life. And it really should make no difference to you what other people think. You know, that's it in a nutshell. My best advice. And that's pretty much the only advice I could really give you. I mean, to cut somebody out of your life totally is kind of absurd, but if you're being bullied about it and things like that, you might want to think about who you're hanging around with. If it's a colleague at work, you know, and they're trying to tell you to eat a piece of cake that they brought in and they're trying to make you feel bad for saying no, just tell them no and don't worry about their reaction because you can't control somebody else's reaction. So anyway, that is it in a nutshell. I don't really have much to say on it. Again, just be yourself, do what's right for you, and don't worry about what anybody else says or thinks. And, um, and then you should carry on and continue and be happy, okay? So stay focused. Have a wonderful weekend. I'll be checking back in with you at some point over the weekend. Um, if you have any questions, you can go to my page on Facebook, uh, FeliciaNurse.com. And I will talk to you guys all soon. Have a great weekend. Bye, guys.